Hello everybody, I am Tadashi Mori and in this video here I will show you how to make this origami F16 jet fighter. To make this origami we are going to use one A4 printer paper. And for angel level members you also have access to the printable diagram. And for the lower level members you have access to the Darkness Dragon 3.2 and the Sauron tutorial. And before we start, a special thanks to all my channel members for making this channel possible. You can become a member starting from $1 a month and you will support my channel and help me keep creating new origamis. Now let's start. Start by folding and unfolding the paper in half. Now you're going to fold and unfold along these lines. and you're going to fold using the previous lines as reference. Now, inside reverse fold along these lines. And you're going to fold and unfold, making the edges go up to the middle point. Now fold the bottom flap up to this mark we just made. Now, repeat on the other direction. Now, make a fold aligning these two lines. And for the next fold, you're going to inside reverse fold this tip here. So to do it, you have to fold and unfold the tip. And you inside reverse along this line. Now fold the front flap along this line. And you're going to make this fold while untrapping this layer. And the model will look like this. Now fold the front layer along this line.
and we're going to repeat the process on the other side. So start by making this fold. Now inside reverse the tip. Now fold the front flap along this line. And again, make this valley fold while untrapping the front part. Now, make this valley fold, spreading the layers evenly. Now, turn the model over. Fold both sides up to the middle line. Fold and unfold along this line. Now, inside reverse fold along the line we just made. Now turn the model over. And you're going to fold and unfold the front flap along this line. Now fold two flaps upward. And you're going to fold and unfold along this line. Pay attention to the reference. So, for the next fold, you're going to use this intersection here as the reference and make a valley fold. Now, on the same flap, make a valley fold aligned with the middle line. Now fold four layers downward. Now we are going to repeat the process on the other side. So again, fold and unfold along this line. Using this intersection point, you're going to make again this valley fold.
and make a valley fold aligned with the middle line. Now spread the layers evenly. Turn the model over. And you're going to make a valley fold on these two tips. Now you're going to fold a single layer along these lines here. And you're going to fold and unfold the next layer along the same line. And you're going to inside reverse fold along the line we just made. Now, turn the model over. And you're going to make a valley fold along this tip here, aligned with the folds behind. Now, you're going to make these two mountain folds on the front layer, and the model will not lie flat. Now for the next fold, we are going to make this sequence of folds, but don't worry, we're going to do it slowly. So start by folding here the sides, and when you do this, you're going to make this V-shaped fold in the middle. As you can see, the model will automatically go to this direction. Now you're going to make a mountain fold and fold the whole model in half. Now, fold and unfold along this line. And you're going to make a sync fold along the line we just made. So, the model will look like this, and again, let's do it slowly. Start by spreading the layers a little bit, like this. And then, you're going to press the middle, so you can finish making all these folds. So, as you can see, when you press the middle, you end up making mountain folds along the lines from the previous fold. And like this, we make a sink fold. Now you're going to fold the wings upward.
and you are going to make a valley fold along this line, so you can spread the wings and finish the model. And, like this, the model is done. I hope you guys liked this video. If you liked it, please do not forget to click on the like button. It's really fast and it helps me a lot. And also, to keep up with my new designs, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And as always, don't forget to be good to the others and to yourself. Thanks a lot for watching this video. See you. Bye bye.